I'm not sure if you pronounce it as Shenmue or Shenmue, because I've heard both. But yeah, the HD remakes of the first two games came out today, and I did buy them. Because I did grow up with the first one, not so much the second one. And I did um, back the Kickstarter for the third game, which is coming out next year, I believe. So, for people who don't know what Shenmue is, I, I'm going to say Shenmue, but I'm not sure if it's Shenmue or Sh Shenmue. It's a weird word. But yeah, for people who don't know, it's a Dreamcast adventure game where you play as someone who basically goes around and asking people for information about something that happened in the game. I'm not going to say any more than that, but I will preface by saying that the game is has probably aged quite a bit. It's probably a little bit clunky, it's a little bit older. It's got some older conventions of games that might not hold up that well today. But taking into account that this was a game on the Dreamcast in the early 2000s, I believe, or the late 90s, it was a very ambitious, story-driven, narrative-focused game for its time. And I thought it was kind of cool what they did back then. I'm not sure if it would still be as good for people nowadays who's who have never played it before but I'm going to go into it just um with relatively rose tinted glasses I guess you could say but if you get over like how old the game is you'd probably start to get invested maybe so we'll just get started and after we're done with this we'll do Sonic Adventure Deluxe so in a way, you're getting a double dose of Dreamcast games tonight. I got the Steam version of it, so... It's on PS4 and Xbox as well. It would be cool if they were on Switch, but they're not. Just need to boot the game up. See, the Steam version has a launcher, so you have to like boot up each game separately. Should show up in a second. There we go. So yeah, I think this is going to be fun to check out. Characters and stories and art are, are a work of fiction. Any similarities are purely coincidental. That old disclaimer. Let me adjust the volume, maybe turn that up just a tiny bit, because this game does have cutscenes and dialogue, so it's probably best to have it at the right volume so you can hear that. Music's pretty good as well. So let's get started. So here is our protagonist, Ryo Hazuki. You've probably seen him appear in some other games, like Sonic and Sega All-Star Racing. The Black Car. If you're wondering why I put emphasis on that, you'll, you'll find out. Oh yeah, the, the quality of the audio is quite low because it's Dreamcast. Ryo-san, uh, I'm alright, but Hazuki-sensei... Uh... My father? Again, keep in mind this is Dreamcast. Even though it's remastered and it, like, is upscaled and stuff, the audio is still heavily compressed. It is jarring, I know. Can you guys hear this thing? Yeah. I'm going to turn it up just a tiny bit more, actually. Father! 
father! Stay back, Mule. For the last time, where is the mirror? I've no intention of telling you. Could be a bit louder. Right. Maybe that will work. I'm pretty sure there's a I'm pretty sure there's a Japanese trope for that where they kick them so hard they like spin. Now then, no matter how often you ask, I'll never tell. This is from Dreamcast era, yep. Kind of is like a Japanese movie, a little bit. We have it. The game hasn't even started yet and already your dad is dead. What a way to start the game. Four days later.
a short long intro, yes, it's quite a long introduction. But I guess in this game it makes sense to like set the the story and the motive and all that. But it won't be that long before we start actually playing. Why was he sleeping with his pants and shirt on? So here's one of the things in this game, you've got a little notebook so you can keep notes of certain things. Let me just alt tap back to the game, there we go. So I've got some phone numbers, there's a couple more numbers. The mirror dragon has been, the mirror with dragon design has been stolen. Landy murdered dad and wore the dragon robe. Rare fighting style tattoo on his arm. Mei Zhuang dad killed a man named Zhao Sheng Ming. What happened that day in the dojo? Right, so that's all the information we've got so far. So it's basically a very narrative driven story adventure game. Also the controls are like tank controls, so I need to get used to this. It's like Resident Evil but a little bit more clunky. Oh, that would be the closet. Right, so I guess we'll go outside then. Your son, you should still be resting. Uh, I'm fine, really. And you? Are you all right? <sighs> yes, but I must keep busy, otherwise I'll get depressed. I understand, but you needn't work too hard. Mm, yes. Oh, by the way, I have this for you. This is for today. From tomorrow, I'll leave it on top of the shoe cabinet every day. Do you know where Fuxan is? Fukara-san? I believe he's in the dojo. Really? Thanks. See, the word is spelled F-U-K-U-San, but the way he says it sounds like he's saying Fuxan. Fuxan? Yeah, that's, that's a little bit of an easy joke to make. Alright, so I guess we'll go to the dojo then. It should be next to the house. So yeah, the cutscenes are still in 4x3, but the actual game runs in 16x9 now, which is pretty cool. This is like the HD version that came out today. Apparently this is one of the high, like the most highly requested Dreamcast games that they wanted Sega to re-release. And since Shinmu 3 is coming out next year, it only makes sense to bring out 1 and 2. Real Get son, people caught up with the story. Is everything okay? Don't worry, I'm fine. I want to ask you about that man. Oh, that man. Uh... The man called Landi. What did he talk with my father about? Landy demanded the mirror, and then they threw me out of the dojo. The black suits? Catch the names? I don't know. They came out of nowhere. I see. Thanks, Fukusan. If you remember anything at all, be sure to tell me. Ryosan, why? What you gonna do? Ryosan! Oh, suddenly where cutscene. Where are you going? You're not going after them! Please, don't! Look what they did to Hazuki-sensei! They killed my father, right in front of me. I will have my revenge. I need to do this, for my father. When you really get down to it, it is a, a plot revenge. It's like a revenge plot, basically. You need to avenge your father. But it's more about the journey than the than the basic like um it's not it's not so much the the why, it's the how. If that's if that makes sense. Oh yeah, so when you hear that beep that you just heard there, I think there's new information in the book. So let's see. Any sun will leave you five hundred yen on the shoe cabinet for me daily. 
I should go to the dojo. I'll get revenge from my father with two exclamation marks. Ask around to see if anyone saw men wearing black that day. Right, so now we can leave the residence and actually start asking around. There's a little doggo. Oh no, that's a cat, sorry. But what was that dog sound? Did you hear that? That may be ambience. So this game's quite old. It's so old that guess which button you press to run? It's the right trigger on the Xbox controller, which actually matches up with the Dreamcast controls. Like the Dreamcast used like the left, the right trigger as well for running. It's a little awkward, but you get used to it pretty quick. Noriko. What's up? About that day. That day? Ah, uh, the day of the incident. I heard about it from Nozomi. It must be hard for you. No, I'm fine. Did you see any men wearing black suits that day? No, I didn't. What about them? It's nothing, really. So yeah, you have to talk to NPCs to learn information. Let's try talking Yo. to him. Hey bro. I want to ask you something. Yeah? What is it? That day. Did you see any men wearing black suits? That day? Uh... No, I didn't see them. I see. Any idea of who may have seen them? Hmm. How about Mishima-san? Or Kondo-san? Those women just might know something. You know, they're always near the payphone in Sakuragaoka. Standing there chatting and gossiping all day. Yeah. Maybe they know, and are chatting about it now. I'll ask them. Thanks. Right, so near the payphone. Can I go in here? Oh, I can. Or... Perhaps they're out? Okay, no, I can't go in there. Right, well, I'll check the girls next to the payphone then. Don't know if I can get anything from these hey. two. Hi, mister! Let's play baseball! Some other time, okay? You know, I was gonna say that playing baseball was probably an American localization, but isn't baseball also really big in Japan? So maybe that was actually faithful. Hi there. Hiya! Are you looking for something? That Nothing face really. though. Yeah, so graphically it has aged a little bit. The faces look a little bit weird sometimes. Like the best looking character is probably Ryo himself, mm -hmm. which makes sense. Hi, Megumi. Uh, uh, you got a kitten in there? You promise not to tell my mommy? Sure. Okay, then I'll show you. Is this your kitten? Uh-uh. But this kitty, see? She's all alone. All alone? Yep. See, the other day, when it rained, a car ran over her mommy. My big sister saw it. She said it was a big black car. A black car? Yeah, and she said it was really scary. And then me and sis, we buried the mommy cat. And so now, I can be the kitty's mommy. But... Mommy says we can't keep the kitten at home. So you're going to keep her here? Yeah, everybody's helping out too. Like Kota, Yasuo, and Kayo. I see. Kitty don't look so good. Think she's hungry? Hmm. Wait a second. Okay. There just so happens to be a piece of food over there, <laughs> for some reason. Dried fish or fried tofu. 
<laughs> I'll take the dry fish. Who would fucking give a cat dry tofu? Do this, so it's easier to eat. She's so tiny, but already an orphan. It's so sad! Yamagishi-san almost got ran over too! Yamagishi-san? Yeah, the car was going so fast, he got shocked and fell! And hurt his backside, so now he stays home all day. When I go to the candy shop, I always stop by to visit him. Yeah, it's close by there. Megumi, you need to be careful around cars, too. Yes. Well, I've got to go now. But wait! We gotta think of a name for the kitty! Oh, well, when I think of a good one, I'll let you know. You promise? Bye-bye, dear. Bye-bye. See, his name is spelt R-Y-O, so it's like Rio. But everyone calls him Dio, which I'm guessing is like the actual pronunciation. It's just weird. Right, let's go into the the little village, the town. Oh, there's the payphone. Yep, there they are. Mishima-san. Oh, hello, Dio. That day of the incident, did you see some men dressed in black suits? Black suits? No. I didn't see them. Well, did you happen to notice anything unusual? Oh, nothing worth mentioning. I'm looking for anything at all. Is there anything you remember? I'm sorry, Dio. The weather was awful, so I stayed inside all day. Did you ask Sumia-san? She knows about everything that occurs in this neighborhood. Is that so? What about you? Um... Oh, hello, Dio! Hello, Dio! Hello, Joe! Kondo-san, the day of the incident, did you see any men in black suits? The day of the incident? You mean the day it thundered, right? I didn't see them. I see. Did anything unusual happen around here that day? Not that I'm aware of. But you know, Sumia-san knows about everything that goes on around here. It'd be good if you tried asking Sumia-san. I see. I love her voice. Her voice is great. Excuse me? Yes? What's this name, plate say? It says Tajima. Does it? I'm trying to find the Yamamoto's house, but see my eyesight is bad, so... Don't worry. I'll look for it. Wait for me in that park up ahead. You're so kind. Thank you so much. Elderly lady looking for Yamamoto's house. Right, where's the park then? I don't know if the park is this way or if it's the. I think it's the other side actually. Yeah, here we go. Have you found it? The Yamamoto's house? No, not yet. Wait here a bit longer, please. I thought it was around here. I'm sorry to trouble you. So yeah, as soon as I find that house, I'll know where she is now. Yuji. Yo. Did you see some men dressed in black suits on the day of that incident? They were wearing sunglasses too. 
Hmm. On that day when it snowed, do you remember? No, I don't. I see. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Mayumi. Hey, Ryo. What's up? Oh, she said Ryo. Oh, I didn't get any follow-up dialogue. Right, okay. I like how she said what's up, but that's the end of the dialogue. Like, there's nothing more beyond that. So, if you're wondering how ambitious this game was in terms of like how much dialogue and lines and stuff there was, the, the Dreamcast version of this game was four discs long. Like this was before like DVDs were commonplace, so they had to they had to get as many discs as possible to like fit all the dialogue onto the game. Uh, I wonder if this is Perhaps they're out. Got a feeling I'm gonna see that happen a lot. I don't think anybody's in. I think it's actually three discs and like the fourth one's like a bonus, I'm not sure. But I do remember it being like four discs in the case. I shouldn't visit without a reason. Okay. Yamagashi-san. Oh, it's you, Ryo. How is your back? Yes, it's much better. But how did you know? I heard from someone in the neighborhood that you almost got ran over by a car. Well, it must have been Megumi or Sumiya-san who told you. That driver was insane. Could you tell me about what happened with that car? Sure. This black car came flying around the corner over by Sakura Gaoka Park and went towards uh, Dubuita. A black car? Did you see the license plate number? Maybe if there hadn't been any snow. And to make matters worse, I fell over. So I never had the chance. Oh, well I'm glad to hear you're okay. But I've got information now about the black car. Black car went toward Dubutia. Dubutia? Dubuita? Sorry, I'm not bad at pronouncing these words. Maybe people who work there saw it. Right, so I guess we're going to go to Dubuita. If you're wondering, do you actually do anything in this game? Yes, there is like action set pieces and there's like combat, but a lot of the early game is like interrogating and finding out information to advance the plot. Here we go, we're in Dubuita. Nope, can't interact with that. I'm not sure how you find out which one's the right house. Excuse me. Huh? Who the hell you think you are? Holy shit. Um, got a minute? Huh? Get out of my space, schoolboy! <laughs> okay. Jesus. And I thought everybody in this fucking little settlement had courtesy. Like, every, like everybody else is like, oh hi there, dear. And then she's like, get out of here! I'm walking here! Perhaps they're out? No one's home? No. I think a couple houses you can actually go in, like maybe they're plot relevant or something, but I'm not sure which ones yet. Maybe I need to get information for the right houses before I can actually go in them. Um, sorry, can't talk now. Talk to you later. Ah, oh, shit! I missed the guy with the motorcycle. Oh yeah, there's like a cola machine. Just needlessly spend money for some soda. Jet Cola, through the orange, through the grape. Is that like Fanta? Jet Soda? Uh, go for Jet Cola. I don't think it really makes a difference. I'm not really sure what the purpose of getting soda is. Maybe it's yeah, for recovering health. Can. Oh. Right, okay. So I guess that's the purpose of buying a can. So this game has like little lottery things, like uh, 
What's the term for it? Gacha? I think is the term for it. It's like little... Oh. <laughs> His face. It's like he was drinking a ah, sour drink. Good. But it was cola. Was it not? So yeah, there's like little mini lottery things that you can take part in this game to win prizes. So I can take that to a retailer and then I can get a prize for it. But let's continue. We'll do that when we find the retailer later. I think I ran by one earlier. Excuse me. What is it, Ryo? I have oh. something to ask you. Sorry, not now. I have something on my mind. Come by the bar later. Ask me then. All right. What an oddly sensual voice she has. That's not like casual speaking voice. Akasakasa. Hi, Ryo. That day, did you see a black car? A black car? I hear it came from Sakuragaoka and drove through Dobuita at full speed. Hmm. I had no idea. I see. Ryo, why don't you try asking people on the shopping street? Maybe someone saw it down there. Yeah? Um... Oh, no, no, no. I'm busy today. If you want to talk, ask someone else. <laughs> Some of the dialogue me. in this game. Oh! Hi there! Wait, is that it? Okay then. Um... Hi, what can I get for you? I have a question for you. Do you remember the day when the snow changed to rain? Yeah, I remember. Did you happen to see a black car? A black car? Oh, hey, that reminds me. You know that girl over at Ida Florist, yeah? You mean Nozomi? Yup. She was spitting mad because some black car splashed mud on her. I don't know the details, though. I see. Nozomi at Ida Florist. Right, okay. I need to know where I need to find out where Ida Forest is. Oh, here it is. Well, that was easy. Nozomi. Ryo, have things settled down for you any? Yeah. If there's anything I can do, be sure to let me know. Yeah. So yeah, this whole game is meant to be like a three-part saga, with Shenmue one and two and three, but three never happened for some reason, and now it's coming out like next year because of a Kickstarter campaign from like two years ago. Excuse me? Yes? Uh, maybe you should stand up straight. I don't think that's good for your spine. Um... Let's see... You're that Hazuki boy! Yes, you're. You really should yes, be standing up yes, straight right. or at the very Nozomi least not tilt your neck like that. Talking about you. I see. Ida-san? Did you see anything unusual the day the snow changed to rain? Snow to rain? <laughs> oh, <laughs> Why is she telling her head so far? Yes, Nozomi came home with mud all over her skirt. Said a car had splashed her. <laughs> Maybe she got bent by Bender. Yeah, that could very well be a possibility. Right, well, I can actually come in here because this is a bar, or it's a food place. Excuse me. How many today? There's something I need to ask you. The day the snow turned to rain? That day the weather was weird? Yeah, that day. Did you see a black car around here? A car? Black? Nah, didn't see it. Really? Have you heard talk around of a black car? Nah, sure haven't. Really? Yeah, I'm sorry if it's a little bit boring me running around asking people stuff. Like, it does start off a bit slow. But you will start seeing things happening before too long, I think. Just need to get my vital information so we can push the story forward. Right, well here's a retailer. Little grocery store. Metal convenience store. Minako-san. What? 
Did you happen to see a black car that day? That day? Do you mean the day it snowed? Yes. No, I didn't see one. I see. I love that MIDI music. How do I give her the can then? Or is it not this store? Minako-san. Um... Hey, Dio. Have you ever used a disposable camera? Not yet. Really? Oh, that's too bad for you. Free drawing at a store raffle. Maybe it's not this store then. Maybe it's like a different store. Just this place. Oh Draw right, okay. Please. I was supposed to press A. No prize. Ah. Especially since you bought merchandise. Wait. So the can says winning can. I give the can to get a chance at the raffle, and the raffle gave me absolutely nothing. Well, it's, it's not really a winning can then, is it? I didn't win so much. I didn't win as so much as it was just getting a chance, is it? What building is this? Asia Travel Company? Um... Wait a minute. I want to finish reading this. Excuse me. What? Did you see a black car drive by here recently? A black car? What kind of question is that? I see black cars driving by here all the time. Humph. Excuse me. You again? Ask somewhere else. Um. Humph. <laughs> Good conversation. Wouldn't even give them the time of day. Excuse me. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. I gotta go fast, yeah. Um. I'm not interested in boys. Sorry. Okay then. Is this the bar? Bar and snack? It's closed. Ah. Wait a minute, what time does it open? Opens at 7pm. Right, well, if I don't forget to, I'll come back and check that place out. I think there's like an arcade nearby. What is this? I like how it has like the opening and closing times listed on the building. Welcome, Fortune teller. Lost one. You know, I don't actually remember this being a thing in this game. Excuse me? You are worried about something, yes? Yes. Shall I read your fortune then? It's 300 yen per reading. No, I don't think so. Well then, please come again when you seek guidance. I will. Goodbye. Did you happen to see the black car on that stormy day? Yes, but I'm not speaking until you pay for your fortune. Right, well... I'm not going to do that. Ocean coffee. I don't think there's a map that you can bring up in this game. So I'll probably end up getting a little bit lost looking for places. Still not open? Oh, right. Opens at 5, it's not quite 5 yet. Karaoke. Bob's Pizza. Hang on a minute, can I go into first person view and look at that sign? Yeah, there we go. Is this the alternative timeline where instead of Bob's Burgers it's just Bob's Pizza? Oh, that's cool, when you focus on something, it shows you it in subtitles. 
Um... What do you want? I need to ask you something. I got nothing to say to you. Um... Who the hell do you think you're talking to? You fighting with me? I've got a question for you. I told you! Forget it! Kiss off, twit! <laughs> Kiss off. Um... What do you want? I want to ask you something. So... You think you got what it takes to fight me, huh? Go on, kiss off, punk. I guess they weren't allowed to say fuck off or piss off back then. When did this game come out? Was it like late 90s, early 2000s? I think it was around that time. This fucking game's nearly 20 years old. Jesus Christ. Sometimes you just don't realise how old something is until you actually think about it for a minute. Uh... What can I do for you? Uh, may I ask you something? What is it? Did you see a black car that day? No, I didn't. I see. Uh, is there anything else? Do you know anyone who said they saw a black car? Nope. I don't think so. I see. I'll see you later. 1999. Right, that sounds about right. One thing I love actually is if you look at the top there, you can see the icon for the the VMU, which is like the Dreamcast memory card. You can also see like the controller icon. Let's do a quick save there. Um, what can I get for you, Ryo? Do you have time now, Hattori-san? What is it? That day, did you happen to see a black car? That day? I didn't go out, so I'm afraid I don't know anything. I see. Weren't there any other witnesses? That's what I am investigating. I see. That son of a... I sure do hope the police catch him soon. Yeah. So, as I may have alluded to earlier, the black car is kind of a meme with this game because early game you ask about the black car a lot. Look at this fucking boy strutting like it's nobody else's business. Hey. Hi, mister! You oh, want to wrestle? Sorry. Maybe later, okay? I think that was the kid that hung out with the, the girl with the, the cat, I think. Or, like, one of the other kids. Maybe if I zoom in, I can see what the names are. Sushi. Right, okay, well, that's cool. You go in the first person and you can actually see what the Japanese dialogue means. Japanese words. Fortune teller. Let's see if I can find the arcade. I think it's somewhere in this district. Is it in the game? It's not quite 5 pm yet, it will be in a few minutes. Karaoke bar. Bob's Pizzeria. Bar Linda. Slot House. Guess I'll check this place out. Excuse me, I'd like to ask you something. This is the best part! Leave me alone! I hit the jackpot! Must be my lucky day! I love some of the NPC voice acting. Like, that's like, that's a good one. Excuse me. Yes? The day the snow turned to rain, did you see a black car drive by here? Well, I don't remember one. Why don't you ask the manager? Yeah, I should. Where is the manager? I'm assuming that's him. Excuse me? Yes? What can I help you with? I'd like to ask you something. About what? Have you seen a black car recently? A black car? Some men wearing black suits were driving it. No, no idea. Hmm. 
Hmm, can I actually read that? Not really going to do the yeah, amusements right now. I was hoping to find the arcade because there's some cool stuff in there that I wanted to check out. I guess I'll go into that bar now. It should be open. Um, wait a minute, wh where was the bar? I think I lost I think I lost track of where the bar actually was. I think it may be a bit further back. Oh yeah, here it is. Saijo san. Yeah, what is it? The day it snowed. Did you see any men wearing black suits? Black suits? Yes. Black suits with black neckties. They were wearing sunglasses too. I didn't see anyone dressed like that. I see. Can't speak for what went on outside, but they sure didn't come in here. See, that's a good point. I actually like... He's asking all these people who have like jobs and professions and like inside most of the time. They wouldn't see this stuff. Like, they wouldn't see a black car. Unless you ran a stall that was, like, facing the street. How do I go first person again? Okay. Just a picture of a guy on a jet ski. Not even, like, a, an animation or anything, it's just a picture. Hi, Ryo. Oh, it's you. Akimi-san. Um... You're still a minor. Ine-san's worried, you know. Alright. Um... You need to go home now. You know you're too young to drink, understand? Alright. Um... Look here, Ryo. Ine-san's worried, you know? Alright. Right, okay then. Not sure how old Ryo actually is, I'm guessing like 16. What's the legal drinking age for the, the US? Is it 16 or 18 or 21? Excuse me. Oh, it's what you, can right. I get for you? Do you have time? What is it? I already talked to that guy. Noriko. Yeah. That day, did you see a black car? The day of the incident? No, I didn't see it. After all, the weather was bad, and it was freezing cold, wasn't it? I was at home all day, and didn't leave. I see. Ugh, trying to talk to that guy there. Are we, son? Yo! Hey, yo, Ryo! Yo, Ryo! Did you see a black car that day? What? A black car? Yeah, a big black car. Well, I heard Nozomi at the flower shop got mud splashed on her by a black car. Nozomi? Yoshie said she saw it happen. Try asking her. Yoshi. Right, I'll do that. Oh, the flower stall must be closed, right. Not sure if I can get any more information out of people right now. I can buy stuff in here, I think. I'm not sure how, though. I don't know how to buy that stuff. I can look at this stuff, but... Oh, I can buy this, though. 
Oops. I'll get this next time. I didn't mean to do that. So yeah, I think the only real purpose no, for buying stuff you? is so you this. can do the raffle. So let me buy this milk and then we can try the raffle again. Come again, y'all. Oh, right, never mind then. How long are you going to play this game? For at least another hour, I think. Hopefully I can get to a really good part before we move on to Sonic. SEGA! Some video music tapes. Potato chips. Oh yeah, this is the thing that gives you the raffle. Because of that girl on it. So I guess I'll buy this then. Yo, may I help you? Yes. Draw a ticket, please. Please give me something good. Fifth prize. The prize is inside the capsule. Okay, what do we get? You probably saw some Sonic stuff there on that picture. Oh, nice. Behold, ninja power! Come again, yo! It's not a bad little prize. Yeah, so there's little figurines you can collect and you can also view them later. Even though this game came out after Sonic Adventure released, it still has like the classic Sonic designs on those little figurines, which is pretty cool. Like the Legacy Sonic. Oh, this is one of the best characters in the game, this guy right here. If you thought Funky Kong was funky, check this guy out. Tom. Hi, Rio. I heard about your father. I'm sorry. Have one of my special dogs. It'll perk you up, I bet. Thanks. I'll have one next time. Anyway, on that day, did anything unusual happen? N no, nothing. I see. Well, if you remember anything, why let did me they know. star? Sure thing. I will. Tom. Hey, yo, keep Whoa, your chin up, up okay? Face. Try my homemade pickles. They're guaranteed to make you happy. Uh huh. I'll drop by later. I love Tom. Oh, it's night time now. So we only have a few more hours before we need to go back home. Also, what the fuck is up with this camera angle? That's not supposed to... Is, is that supposed to happen? Because that looks like they're appearing inside the building with a cardboard wall. Right, what about you? Do you know anything about the black car? Honey, son. Hi, yo. On the day of that incident, did you see a black car? A black car? Nope, that day I was sick in bed. But Tom was working the truck here. Why don't you ask him? I see. Okay. So let's see, how do we view our items? Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's called Gacha. So it's like little figurines you get from capsules. But there's a whole bunch of stuff here. It's not just Sonic stuff, it's also like Sega stuff in general. Yeah, here's SPL, based off of Knuckles Chaotix. Pretty cool that they went through all the trouble to make these models, specifically for this one smaller part of the game. I like that. But yeah, there's like a whole bunch of them. There's like a, a capsule machine nearby where you can actually get more of them. But I think Metal Sonic is like a really rare one. Oh, here's the arcades. Oh, it's not closed for another a bit, so we can check it out real quick. Ichiro, hey bro. I want to ask you something. Huh? What's up? That day. Did you see a black car? That day? Uh, sorry, afraid not. I see. I wonder if anyone knows about that black car. Hmm, let me think a bit. Sorry, no one I can think of. I see. See you later. Yeah. Hey, 
Listen, Ryo. Hmm? I'm sick of Naoyuki going on about his motorcycle. Whether or not he's gonna change the tires. I can't stand to hear it anymore. I see. He'll bore you to death too, I'm sure of it. Nah, I like hearing about it. See ya. Yeah, later. Haven't had any new information for a Yuji. while. Yo. Did you see a black car on the day of the incident? Hmm. On the day when it snowed, do you remember? I didn't see anything. I see. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Do you know anyone who might have seen something? Let me think. Why don't you try asking people in Dobuita? That car must have gone through Dobuita if it came from here. Good point. Why don't you try asking people in Dubuita? What do you think I've been doing all day? Right, so this place has a few Sega arcade games in it. There's also darts. There's Super Hang On, I guess I could check that out. Super Hang On's a fun Hang little on. arcade game. 100 yen a game. Doesn't cost that much to give it a shot. I should try it once. Yeah, I don't I don't want to put in nine hundred. Oh, you use the D pad for this, right? Hang on a second. Game volume on this is louder than the actual game itself. So yeah, you may have seen this. It's been ported to like the Sega Genesis, but this is like the arcade version, like the original. If you've ever bought a Sega Genesis that had like those one... What, what are they called? It's like three or six games in one or something that comes with the system. You usually find it there. Basically, Rad Racer, but with more bikes. So, yeah, it's pretty cool that all the arcade games have been retained so that you can check them out. I mean, they are owned by Sega, so it's not like there's a licensing issue. Nice checkpoint. So yeah, you need to get to the checkpoints before the time runs out. If you've ever played an arcade racer, it's the same format. See how far I can go on just a single credit and then we'll leave. I'll check out the other arcade games later. Oh shit. <laughs> it's not enough to fucking spin out, but it's just your fucking motorcycle just goes Michael Bay and explodes. In the most tremendous way possible. Yeah, because there's a lot like Shenmue in terms of like that stuff. Yeah. That doesn't surprise me really. Yeah, because there's from Sega as well, isn't it? I'm not going to make it. That crashed at me in. I was right round the corner from the next checkpoint. We'll give that another try another time. But I guess I could put in my initials. Oh fuck. Wait, how did I... Oh fuck. Oh damn it. Right, okay. I'm a bit confused as to how this works. Like the buttons are not mapped where I thought they would be mapped. Fuck it. Yeah, I was trying to press left and right to select the letters there. That's not what left and right does. And then pressing down confirms what you were highlighting, so I wasn't quite sure how to properly select the letters. Never mind. 
I was just going to type in Rio anyway. It was getting late. I should probably start heading back. We can't really go any further from here anyway. So yeah, you can only stay out for so long because obviously you're... You're a, a little baby boy and you've got like a, a mummy that you need to go back to, so... We'll go back and then we'll start inquiring some more once he wakes up. Just need to go all the way back here through Dobuita into Sagakori or whatever that was. Hi James Welding, welcome to the stream. Not sure if you've seen this before. So how do you guys pronounce this game's name? Is it Shenmue or Shenmue? Like with emphasis on the, the letter U. I call it Shenmue but I've heard both ways. Yeah the game has a bit of a time limit. Shenmue. It's going to be weird saying that because that's not how I'm used to saying it. Ine-san. Gyo-san, you mustn't be reckless. It won't change anything. All I right, the volume. I scold you, but I will say what I have to say. Ine-san, I understand. I forgot to turn the volume back up there because that arcade game was louder than the actual game itself. I'm not sure which one is my bedroom, I forgot. Is it this one? Oh no, this is Fuxan's. Fuxan, what is it, Ryosan? Did you see the car those guys were driving? I'm sorry, I didn't see it. I see. Wait, what's that poster he's got on the wall there? Oh, it's Virtua Fighter. Right, cool. I'm not sure what this one is, though. Like, they try to make the world as immersive as possible, but they also have a lot of, like, Sega... I wouldn't say product placement, more like Sega references. Oh, that's the bathroom. No, I don't want to go in there. I don't need to use the bathroom. Even though I've been out all day and I drank milk and a soda, I don't need to drink. I don't need to go into the bathroom. Thanks. So, I, I, I don't remember where my room is. Yeah, forget about the black car. I'm trying to find my bedroom now. I'm looking for my bedroom on that stormy day. Have you seen it? No, yo, I have not seen it. Maybe you should ask Fuxan. Thanks. So I'm gonna assume it's one of these two doors then. I think I've checked every other door except for these. Right. This is it. Let's do a quick save. And then let's sleep. Apparently we can do training, but I don't think there's any point to doing that right now. Hey Zachary. 
So every day I get a little bit of vanilla. I have to be sure not to waste this. Get 500 yen a day. Right, let's go and spend all that money on gambling. Nah, we don't need to do that. How funny would it be though if we went there and we spent like a couple hundred yen and we got like 10,000 yen back. Yeah, but be careful when playing in the road. Okay. Wait up, Yasuo. Wait for me. Okay, so this game, it's technically not the game that started the whole QTE thing. Like, there's been games that predate this. But this is the game that coined the term quick time event. And that was like one of the early examples of that. So get ready for more QTEs later, those are going to be a thing. Is there any more dried fish up here? Maybe I can give it the dry, <laughs> the dry tofu instead. Oh no, there's nothing here. Yeah, I should probably buy some fish for the cat. I think that's like a, a side quest of sorts where you just like feed it fish every day. So we'll go to Dubuita, we'll talk some more, we'll buy some fish, and then at the end of the day we'll come back and feed it. Hopefully it'll be fine. Doggo. I should probably be doing that for every house so I can figure out which house was that one house I was looking for. Hey. Hey mister! Wanna play with me? Some other time, okay? One hundred yen each. Well, let's try some gacha. One. See what we can get. This one apparently has Virtua Fighter stuff in it. It may have some other Sega stuff. The other one has some Sonic things in it. Oh, it's a Virtua this Fighter. Is cool. I've never really played Virtua Fighter, so I don't know who this is. Kinda looks like a bootleg Ken. Jackie. Maybe I should get another. Yakuza has this sort of stuff as well, doesn't it? Hey, what's this? Ew. Maybe I should get another. I'll pass. I'm gonna try some Sonic ones, see if I can get some good Sonic stuff. 100 yen each. I should buy one. Just blowing through my daily allowance. Just to get some toys. I'm a totally responsible non adult. Oh, it's Tails. This is cool. Nice. I think that's like one of the rarer ones because it's like, it's not quite Sonic, but it's like, like associated with Sonic. I should try again. There's actually a bunch of Sonic characters, like those like obscure ones, like fucking the polar bear from Sonic the Fighters, Bean the Duck, like stuff like that. Is that Amy Rose? Yep, that's Amy. This is cool. That's pretty cool. I'll buy one more. Maybe I should get another. I want knuckles. Please give me knuckles. Ah, oh, fuck! It's Espio again. What? This again? <laughs> he even fucking acknowledges it's a duplicate. That's brilliant. I should try again. You know what? One more time. 
I've already spent my daily allowance plus 100 more, but fuck it. Oh, that's not Sonic. Huh? Oh, it's like a little... It's like a little prop comedy weight thing. Heavy bomb. Okay then. I should try again. It's like that thing from Kirby. Changed my mind. Yeah, forget that. We'll come back and check that again later. I love hearing that dog, but never actually seeing the dog. Is this woman still in the park? No, she's not there, right. The water. Please understand. No one's home. Right, let's go to Dubuita then. Got another day of inquiring to do. Hopefully we can find some major information this time. Like I talked to almost everybody here, so we must have missed someone. Excuse me. Oh, hello. Did you see a black car around here that day when it snowed? A black car? I'm sure it went past here real fast. Right here in front of Water Dragon Thrift Store. I think I may have heard it, but I didn't see anything. I see. Where are you playing? It's called Shenmue. It's a Dreamcast action adventure game. A lot of it has you basically talking to people to find information, but there's also like combat that happens later on once you start getting the game going. Nozomi. Ryo, have things settled down for you any? Yeah. If there's anything I can do, be sure to let me know. Yeah. Yeah. On that day the snow changed to rain. I heard you were splashed with mud from a speeding car. Yeah. What kind of car was it? It was black. And the kind of luxury car you don't normally see around here. Did you see who was in the car? No, I didn't. It was too fast. But I heard a rumor that Tom had an argument with the people in the car. Do you mean Tom at the hot dog truck? Yeah. Why are you asking about that car? No reason. See you later. Ryo. Hmm? Cheer up, will ya? Yeah. See you. I knew Tom was hiding something because he stuttered when I talked to him about the black car. So let's go talk to him. Where is that hot dog stand? I think it's this way. Yeah, I don't remember where that hot dog stand was. I know it's somewhere around here. So bear with me while I f look for it. There he is. Tom. Hey, Rio! Tell me about those men in the black car. What? Nozomi told me you had words with the guys driving the black car. No, no, I don't remember. They might have been the ones who murdered my father. Your father? Please try to think. All right, man, I'll try. Those guys in the black car, what were they like? I saw a guy wearing this weird coat. What kind of coat? It was a deep green, maybe velvet or silk, like something Chinese. That's Landy. What happened? They almost hit one of my customers, so I gave them a piece of my mind. But that man, he gave me this glare. I ain't never seen such a cold stare, man. Do you remember anything else? Nope. Try asking Chinese people about Chinese. Do you know any Chinese? Sorry, man. 
But see that travel agency over there? They get some Chinese customers. I'll ask around for you too, man. Come by later. Sure. I don't know why, but Tom is kind of giving me a bit of a Tommy Wiseau vibe. It's probably nothing to do with the fact that he's named Tom. I think it's more to do with his mannerisms than anything. Haha, <laughs> what a story, Rio. Oh, this is different from the other travel agency we were in, with that rude lady. Excuse me. Yes? I'm looking for someone who knows about Chinese people. Do you know anyone? Why don't you try the Chinese restaurant near the drugstore? You mean the Ajiji? Yes? I'm sure their employees are all Chinese. Thank you very much. Ajiji. Right, okay. We're finally getting somewhere now. Most of yesterday we didn't really advance any of this story, but now we're getting some vital information. Is this the Ajiji? Nope, that's Bakery. What did they say it was? It was next to the pharmacy or something? Next to the chemist? That's a butcher's. It's not even midday yet, but I've, I'm just going to try to do this as quickly as possible. Can I talk to this guy while he's on the bike? Nope. Doesn't let you do that. One thing I will say about the Resident Evil tank controls is... You can press down and it turns around instead of like pressing down plus A. So at least that's like one step less to actually turning. Lunches. Antiques. Got a feeling I'll be using this feature a lot where I have to like look at stuff. Oh shit, is that guy using black suits? Hey, wait a minute! Like the ones I'm looking for. Hey, Hazuki. You think you can bump into me and not even apologize? Yeah, jerk. Apologize to Enoki-san. Or maybe I'll just beat an apology out of you. Mm, okay, maybe this is like different guys. I don't have time guys. for this. Get lost. I think it. we're in for a fight. <laughs> Fuck. Come on, loser. <laughs> yeah. I didn't realize it was going to be a QTE. I thought it was like an actual combat. Shit. Come on, loser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, you're pretty tough. I don't have time to play your little games. Yes, uh, I'm sorry. You don't mess with me again. Got it? All right, all right. Uh. Well, at least I didn't fail. Oh, hey, are you okay? Can you get up? Uh. <laughs> well, that was fun. Also, thanks, game, for making me go the wrong way. Or, actually, no way, I was going the right way. I actually got turned around there as a result of that encounter. That's a burger stall. Boigas. What's this door say? Naji Industries. It's closed. Right, maybe it's down this little side street then. Excuse me. Forgive me. See, I'm rather tuckered out at the moment.
ramen. Ono-san. Oh, it's you, Ryo. I heard you had a hard time. Yeah. Are you okay now? Yes. I feel a lot better now. Don't overdo it. Oh, right. Thought I was going to ask him stuff. You know, ju just for the sake of it, let's just do one slot machine go and see if we actually get some money back to make up for the lost money in the gacha, gacha game. One bet. Excuse me. I'd like to ask you something. This is the best po- Leave me alone! I hit the- Must be my- I didn't mean to interact with him. I meant to interact with this. 20 tokens for 100 yen. Sure. Give me some big money. Um, oh, right. Oh, nice. So how much money is that going to be? Win two. You did it! Oh, thanks. Seriously? Here is your triple seven prize. Oh. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get money there. I mean, I might get money as well. Thanks. But they got like a, a weird gacha toy. Yeah, I could probably. Yeah, let's pay out. Holy shit. Um, how do we... Yeah. Oh. Didn't mean to do that, but okay. I think I need to press the B button. Let me just use this up real quick. Right. That's enough for now. Wait, did I get all that money or what? Bet. Let me see how much money I've got. Oh, I still have the money here. Um, right, well, how do I pick up that money then? I'd better quit now. Does Maybe anyone know how to more. pick up the money from here? Because I don't understand how this works. I'd better quit now. I'll give it another try. That's enough for now. Yeah, hang on. Let me try quitting. Remaining coins can be kept at the counter. Excuse me. Yes? What can I help you with? I'd like to ask you something. About what? Who's the best person in town to ask about people from China? Chinese people? No, no idea. So apparently I can't keep the money, but I can keep it inside the in the amusements so that I can use it for later. How do I do that? 
Let's try the one token one. I'll play it once. I mean, oh. Sorry, hang on a second. Dropped my controller like an idiot there, but it's alright. The controller was not that far from the ground. Uh, yeah, I don't know how to. See, I'm kind of worried that if I leave, I lose all this money. I'm not quite sure how to like cash this in or like give it to the guy at the counter. Uh, fuck it. Now. Screw it. It'll probably be there when I come back. I'm wasting time. Excuse me, sir. Yes. I can hold your leftover coins for you. Oh, right, okay. Would you please? Right, cool. Thank you very much. You just have to leave and he does it for you automatically. That's cool. Right, so I need to find the Chinese restaurant next to the... There is. It just so happens to be on this road. Tao-san. Yes? Are there any other Chinese people around here? Why do you want to know about other Chinese? Uh, nothing, really. Is it something to do with what happened to your father? Yes. Oh no. Not all Chinese people are bad. I understand that. But the only clue I have is that they were Chinese. Please. Is there anything you could tell me? You say Chinese people around here? But there's quite a lot of them compared to before. We don't really know the newcomers. I see. Why don't you tell him about the Three Blades? Oh, the Three Blades. Three Blades? What are the Three Blades? It literally refers to three different blades that represent three different trades. The barber, the tailor, and the cook. They all use bladed tools. The barber uses a razor. The tailor uses scissors. And the cook uses knives. Ah, I get it. Most of the Chinese who came to Japan were one of the three. It doesn't cost much to set up, so you can start the business quickly. People of the three blades also know each other very well. It's a good idea to ask them if you're looking for information on people from China. Who are some of the Three Blade people around here? For the barber, visit Maeda-san. For the tailor, see Itoi-san, who's making patches now. For the cook, go and ask Mampu Cook and Ramen. The Three Blade people should know about other Chinese people as well. Oh, there's also another barber shop, the Liu Barber and Hair Salon, but... But Liu Sun's father is in the hospital now. His family's having a hard time. The shop's been closed recently. So, I should go and speak with Maeda-san, Itoi-san, and Man Pukuken Ramen, right? Yes. I, I did, see. I did see a ramen store Thank you very earlier. Much. So maybe that's one of those three. Right, so we've got three people we need to go ask stuff. I wonder how long it took for them to localize all of like the dialogue in this game. Where was that ramen store? Nice face. I'm trying to look at the sign so I can see what the name of this place is. Military surplus.
Yeah, my guess is that. Oh, it's you, Leo. <laughs> Are you making progress? <laughs> Why are you looking up at such an odd angle? Keep up your training. Yes, I will. I'll do my best. That's got to be the fucking thumbnail for this video when I upload this to YouTube. Like, seriously. Excuse me. Sorry, but could you come back a bit later? Maybe if I stand at a slightly different angle, his neck will be super twisted. Let me see. What if I stand over here and then talk to him? Oh, right, I can't actually t interact. Hang on. Oh, I can't talk to him, period, now. Oh, wait, there we go. I'm trying to get to a spot where it will let me actually talk to him. Um, forgive me. Would you mind asking someone else? Not as bad as it was before, but... Nope, that's not ramen. Oh. Gotta love it when you get stuck against the wall for a second while well, the game tries to make you turn the rounds. A mini-map would have been nice, so you could remember where stuff was. I guess they didn't want to have a mini-map because it would break the immersion somewhat. Like, a notebook makes sense because you're trying to like take notes of stuff important that happens. But I guess they didn't want to have like a big map screen that shows up. Although that said, it would be cool if you could like buy a physical map of like the town, like a tourist map for example. And then you could like check that out to find like the nearest spots. I think this is the ramen store. Yep. Oh shit, it's shut. It's closed. When does it open? Ah. Right, okay, it's... Wait, what, 5, 5 a.m.? What? What do you mean 5 a.m. to 4 a.m.? Like, it's open for 23 hours, but it's shut now? Unless I'm reading that wrong, but I think that's what that's saying. Right, well, we've got two other places we can check. Where's the barbers? Did I just hear a glass smashing? Uh... Maybe if I ask around, the people will tell me where places are. Hang on. Excuse me? Oh, I'm sorry. I have to go now. I see. My planet needs me. What about you? Hi. Hey, you. Want to check out something? I got some uniforms from the U.S. Navy. No thanks. Maybe next time. Tatsumi-san. Hello. What can I do for you? Want to check out something? Just between you and me, I got me a pair of very rare jeans. No thanks. Maybe next time. Okay then. So yeah, you probably noticed I started the stream a little bit late tonight. I wanted to take a nap before I started the stream because I was... Like, when you watched me play Okami last night, I was very tired. Like, I underestimated how tired I really was. So I wanted to make sure I actually had the nap in before I started tonight's stream. I'm feeling pretty good, actually. I'm not doing Okami tonight, though. I might do that tomorrow. Partially because I wanted to start this, since this just came out. 
Wait a minute, is that the barbers? Nope. Like, I don't want to focus on that character, I want to focus on the sign. Oh no, that's the bakery. I'll ask around, see if I can get information. Ugh. Excuse me. So sorry. I have to go now. I see. Everyone has to go now, apparently. Kominasa. Hi. What can I get you? You look busy. On the contrary. Well, my bread isn't selling as well as before. What? I'm not worried about Tom's hot dogs or that hamburger place over there much, but Bob's Pizzeria. He's a tough competitor. I see. I mean, if you think about it, pizza is like mostly bread. So it's like you're getting more than just bread. Hattori-san? Hi! How's business? Well, it's up and down. But nowadays, soccer is hip. And I'm not very happy about it. Baseball is supposed to be the sport, you know. Um, Hattori-san. Yes? Excuse me, I'm in a hurry. Oh, I see. Uh, see ya. Yes. What well, weird... What well, a weird conversation. Oh, these kids today are all about soccer, but baseball is the true one sport. I tell you what. Well, there's Bob's Pizzeria. Doesn't really have anything to do with the plot, but... Oh, that's the amusements. Can I go inside the pizzeria, or is this purely for display? Nope, there's an opening time there. Opens at 5. Opens at 6.30. Could always check the karaoke out if it's open. Uh, not till 7. Still got a bit of time to wait before we can do any of those. Guess they're not open yet. So correct me if I'm wrong, but if it says 5am to 4am, that would mean 23 hours, right? And from 4am to 5am it would be closed. I'm a bit confused about this one. Maybe I can get in from the side. Nah, there's no side door. Oh wait a minute, is that a map? Oh shit, there is a map! I did not know there was a fucking map in this game. Right, so where's the barber? Right, barber media. All the way down there. It's next to the butchers. Also next to the... Oh, it's... I think it's next to the arcades. Or is it... Wait a minute, where's the arcades? Oh, right, we're here. I just realised there's a red line pointing where I am, so... Five PM. No, it can be five PM though, because um, it's showing it in like twenty-four hour format. So it should be, uh, it should be fifteen hundred, uh, not fifteen hundred, seventeen seventeen hundred hours, if it's five PM. Right. Okay. So I think I know where to go now. So we go down this way, take the intersection, and then yeah. Right. Okay. I had no idea there was a map in this game. That's super useful. I don't know if you can like buy a tourist map or if it's just like billboard maps. I thought that was like a detail in the background and I was close enough to realise, oh wait a minute, this is an actual map that you can look at. What's your problem? Excuse me. Huh? Me? What's up? Are you one of those young Nagai Industries guys? No, it's not that. Then let me alone, will ya? 
I've been wondering, why are you always here? Waiting. For Nagai-san, you see? He doesn't see me, but I trust him more than anybody. I can't give up that easy. I see. I'll be doing some Sonic Adventure shortly if you're wondering, like maybe in the next half an hour. Right, I think this is the... Oh shit, it's shut. It's closed. So wait. Oh, right, okay. Well, that's weird. Wait. What time is it right now? It's not 7 p.m. yet. What? It's not even 6 p.m. and it's closed already? I'm confused. Maybe I'm not supposed to go to the barbers yet? Let me look for a map and check the other place. What was the other place again? It was like a tailor or something. I forgot the name of it. Right, here's a map. Oh yeah, I should check the notes actually, the notes will tell me. Mary's patches and embroidery, right, okay. Oh, here we go. It's actually very close. I think it's on this street. It might be shut already, actually. Hang on a second. Let me just make sure I'm going on the right street here. Oh, wait a minute, we're not on... Right, okay, I'm looking at the wrong thing. We're on th this street. We're supposed to be down here. Right, uh... Okay, I think I know where I'm supposed to go now. I love that music that plays when you walk by the convenience store. Uh, we're... Uh, looking for a map so I can see where I am right now. Right, Barber's right behind me. I don't know if this is the Barber I'm looking for, there's like two of them. Okay, this one's open. Aw, oh, shit, really? Looks like they're gonna close. I should go. No, I want to ask them questions! Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! fucking walked in like three minutes past six and then it fucking kicks me out. Come on. Right, where's the other place? All the shops should be shutting by this point anyway, so I'm not sure if the other place, the the Patches place, is going to be open until like seven. Where is the Patches place? Let me check the map again. Um, where was it? Don't you love it when you saw something and then you don't remember where you saw it? It's like the best, isn't it? It was like Mary's Patches or something? Oh, there it is, Patches Mary. Right, so it's just around the corner, actually. It's probably closed. So I'll probably head back home early so we can advance a day and then we can check it. Oh no, it's still open. Um, yes! 
Itoi-san, do you know about the three blades? Who told you about that, son? I heard it from Tao-san. I see, I see. That's why I'm looking for Chinese people that are members of the Three Blades. In that case, I suppose you could ask Liu-san. Liu-san? That's right, over at the barber's. I see. Right, But well, Itoi-san, can we go to the barber's the right now? Years ago, I was Chinese. Now, I'm a naturalized Japanese. In China, my name was Su Jianmen. Is that so? Thank you. See you. Wait, you can just change your nationality like that? Many years ago, I was Japanese or Chinese, sorry. And now I'm Japanese. Because it totally works like that. Yeah, so we can't go to the Leo Barbers right now because it was already closed. Probably just start heading home at this point and then we can... We'll do one more day, or at least part of one more day. Oh fuck, is that a guy that's drunk? Uh, are you alright? I'm just fine and dandy! <laughs> are you sure? I'm okay! I'm okay! Turn around so I can see your lovely face. I'm doing fine and dandy! Right, let's go back to... Go back to the residence then. I don't think there's like a quick travel thing in this game, you just have to like run all the way back. I wonder if the gacha thing's still open, maybe we can get a couple more toys. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to buy fish for the cat. I just realised. That was the one thing I didn't do yet. I think the convenience store opens still very late. I think you can buy fish in here. I mean, there is milk, we could get milk. Oh, wait, here we go, a sliced fish. This'll work, right? Yo, may I help you? This. That drunk guy sounds like <laughs> Mitch Brian. Yeah, from Family Guy. Come again, yo. I've now spent double my allowance. Where is the... It's this way. So I won't do one more full day, but we'll do just a tiny bit more of the next day just so we can get the information we need. Like I said, it starts off a little bit slow because you need to, like, inquire a bit to find out things. I love how the kids just, like, strut. Haters gone hate. Right, well, this convenience store is closed, but I think these things are always usable. 100 yen each. Yeah, they're still usable. Nah, not today. Hang on a second. I'm trying to get I to the Sonic these. one. But here we go. One more. I should buy one. One more for today. Oh, is that Sonic? Nice. Hmm, I know this. Do you think? It's on the fucking picture there. Oh, there's more than one Sonic. I should try again. Nah. I'm happy with that. Changed my mind. We got both Sonic and Tails. don't want to go spending all of my money because I only get 500 yen per day and I want to save the rest of it for other stuff.
Ah, uh, doesn't that feel good? I think I need to go into the item screen to give it something. Right, here you go. Want some food? I just need to feed it once a day, I think. Seems you were hungry, huh? There we go. Ine-san. What is it? Do you know the Dew Barber and Hair Salon? It doesn't look like you need a haircut just yet. Yeah, that's right, but I was thinking about changing my hairstyle. Is that so? Well, I suppose that wouldn't be a bad idea. I'll give you some extra allowance money tomorrow. Oh, nice. No thanks, Ine-san. Oh, I have means. enough. Well, if you say so. Uh, I want some extra money so I can... So that I can totally go and get my hair cut, yeah. Not gonna go to that gacha game again. Right, let's go to the salon. I don't think there's any way to like advance time if you're too early, so Ine-san is always there for me. We may have to do some other stuff if we are there too early. Guess we could hit the arcade. But we can fast travel to Doboita from here, which is actually cool. But you can't really fast travel once you leave the house. We're probably here too early, if anything. Right, where was the salon again? Let's see. Right, okay, so we're actually right next to it. Opens at 10. Right, so we've got one hour of in-game time before that opens. I guess I'll go do another round of Super Hang On then, and then we'll come back. If I remember where the arcade was. Yeah, here it is. Oh, is it not open yet? Shit. Of course it would be open at the same time. Right, I'll go to the convenience store and buy the fish for the cat then. I'm basically just waiting for that store to open before we can actually go inside. We can also buy canned tuna. It's cheaper as well, so yeah, let's try that. Yo, may I help you? This. I also have that bottle of milk you. that I bought the other day, so maybe I can use that also. Gonna buy. Oh, yeah, those dried fish as well. Was that next to the dried fish? Oh, that's nothing. Right. Food. 
flashlight. Where is the... Yeah, here it is. I'm gonna buy one of these and see if I can get a decent prize. Yo, may I help you? Yes. Draw a ticket, please. So yeah, you, some people might realize that this is kind of like Yakuza, but this was like I think this was before Yakuza, or it was like no prize during that game's infancy. Especially since you bought merchandise. Oh well. But yeah, Yakuza is a game series that's very much like this, but there's a lot more you can do in that game. And it's one of those games that I do want to check out. I don't know if I'll stream it, but I want to see if I can... I want to beat the Shenmue series first before then, so... Once Shenmue 3 comes out and I finish that game, I'll probably start looking into Yakuza. I can't really promise I'll stream it though, but I might check out at least one of them on stream. I've been told that Yakuza 0 is a really good starting point. It was nearly 10 a.m. Went the wrong way again. Yakuza didn't come out till 2005, right, so it predated it basically. Yeah, so I'm assuming that uh, Shenmue was always intended to be like a three part saga, but the third part had basically never happened, probably because, like, the Dreamcast failed. So it's kind of cool to see that Shenmue 3 is still going to happen, and we'll be seeing that next year. Shenmue 1 and 2 were Dreamcast games, so it's going to be a big bump up in graphics when we get to the third game. Just need to wait for it to get to 10. It's closed already. I like how the sign changed from closed to open while I was trying to open the fucking door. I don't know if you saw that there. You, son. Hello. Welcome. How would you like your hair today? I'm not here for a haircut. I came to ask about people from China. And you are? I'm Yo Hazuki of the Hazuki Dojo in Yamanose. Hazuki, son? Darling, you saw it in the paper on that snowy day. Ah, I understand you've gone through a lot. Oh, hang on a second. I'm looking for a Chinese man who goes by the name Lan Di. Tao Sun and the others of the Three Blades said that perhaps you'd know. So, Tao Sun referred you to us. Well, I'm a second generation Chinese, so I don't think I can be of much help. Maybe they meant your father. Oh, I see. Sorry, I was doing something in the background my there. My father's 80 years old. He owned a shop in Yokohama from before the war. Maybe he knows. He's been in hospital for the flu and was just discharged yesterday. He's been through a lot, so we've kept it closed for a while. Is he all right? Oh, he's much better now. Perhaps he's exercising in Suzume Park. Suzume Park? He walks once around Obuita and eats at the Soba restaurant every day. Thank you very much. I'll try there. Suzuki Park. Right, cool. Finally, we have a lead. Just need to remember where the map was. Here it is. Is that part like I see a place called Park, but it doesn't really have a name to it. I'm gonna assume that's what it is. So actually hang on a second, let me just double check. Just gotta make sure I'm going the right way. Right, okay. By the end of this game, I'm going to memorize, like, every single aspect of this street without having to look at the map.
Yeah, so for people wondering, I have played this game like years ago and I did beat it. But I had no idea there was maps in it. Like, I honestly thought there was zero maps in this game, but it turns out they're like plastered on those billboards. Park is just around the corner. Right, here we are. Right, this is the right park. Um, are you Dio, son? Yes, I am. And you? My name is Dio Hazuki, from the Hazuki Dojo in Yamanose. Ah, I've heard what happened to your father. My condolences. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a Chinese man who calls himself Lan Di. Three Blades members like Ajiichi's Tao Sun suggested that perhaps you might know. Ah, you know of the Three Blades. I know it refers to the three professions, barbers, cooks, and tailors. That it does. Did you know that the proud elite of these professions were also imperial bodyguards? protecting emperors from assassinations with their razors, knives, and scissors. About Landy, I gather by his name that he is most likely a member of a Chinese black market cartel, or perhaps even the Chinese mafia. Would they be here in Yokosuka? They have developed a base in the harbor to bypass customs and expand their activities. Try asking some of the sailors in the vicinity. They're bound to know more. Sailors? I'll look for some. Thank you very much. Good luck. Right, so sailors then. Guess we're no longer asking about the black car, we're going to ask about sailors. Oh, never mind, I can't talk to him if he's on the bike. Hi, what can I get you? I'm looking for some sailors. Sailors? Well, I always see them near bars. What? Well, you know what I mean. I just see them hanging out. I see. Most of them are pretty big, so you can miss them. Do you know a place where sailors hang out? Um, I heard there's a bar where sailors hang out, but I don't know the place because I've never wanted to go to such a bar, you know? I see. It's best to stick to your regular drinking hole, if you know what I mean. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? Do you know of any places where sailors hang out? Sailors come in here sometimes, about their navy stuff. Usually they try and sell to me. About when do they come by? It's not like they come all the time, you know. I see. I love that guy's smug-ass face. In fact, let's get a close-up of that. I was hoping he would turn around there. I guess I need to face him directly. Oh, then he turns his face. Hang on a second. These awkward tank controls make it difficult to line him up. Right, here we go. There we go. There's a pretty good smug ass face. Might actually have to put that in the thumbnail as well. I'll put the, both of those faces in there. Like him being smug and that other guy with the super ass twisted neck. It's Larry Butts. <laughs> it kind of is, actually. You know what they say, when something smells, it's usually the butts. But yeah, welcome to the stream. So... Guess I'll ask him about the bar. Oh, no, or the sailors. Hey, Ryo! Ryo! Do you know any place where sailors might hang out around here? Sailors? There should be a lot of them in the bars around here at night. Bars. Thank you. 
night time. Right, well I don't think I'm going to do another full day of this. In fact, why don't we do one more round of Super Hang On? And then we'll save the game and then we'll do that the next time. You probably noticed I changed the title of the stream already because I'm going to be moving on to Sonic Adventure in like five minutes. Let me just go find the arcade again if I remember where it was. I've got a question for you, Tev. Does this kind of remind you of Tommy Wiseau? Tom. Hi, Dio. Do you know any place where sailors hang out? Sailors? Yeah, I do. They hang out at bars. They always start street fights when they're drunk, you know. I can't stand them, man. Which bar do they hang out at? I don't know. I'm broke. I can't afford to drink. Oh, well. Later. Tommy Wiseau with the tannin dreads. It really is. <laughs> Jamaican Wiseau, yeah. Right, let's do another round of Super Hang On then. Hang on, 100 yen a game. Guess I'll try it. Let me adjust the volume because this game is louder than the actual game itself. On that down, there we go. Just one credit. We could probably do better this time than the last time. So yeah, we got a little bit done in terms of this story. We managed to find out some information. We need to talk to some sailors to find out about the Chinese operations for the Chinese mafia. mafia. So when I come back to this, probably before the weekend, we will advance to like night time and then check out the bars and ask around. Oh that was weird. The game paused there for a second, but that was not me. I think that was the emulation, or maybe because I'm playing on PC and it's like lagging. I think that more has, I think that has more to do with my hard drive than anything, because my hard drive, the one that I install my Steam games onto, doesn't have the fastest RPM. I think you need to mod me on this account, right? I'll give you a mod on that one then. Right after this. I'm gonna try not to crash this time on this part of the road. Show of hands, how many people have played Super Hang On for the Sega Genesis? Because that's the version of Hangout that I am most familiar with. Come on. Nope, not gonna make it. I was right there as well, God damn it. Don't know where the buttons are for this. Oh, it's the control stick. I was using the D-pad and the D-pad wasn't working right. N no. Control stick, please. Whatever. 
I'm not I'm not even sure what's going on with the control stick there. I'm trying to move left and right to select the letters and sometimes it just confirms the letter without my consent. Whatever. I'll show you the other arcade stuff over time. I'm not going to show you everything at once. We'll kind of space it out over the adventure. So with that, I'm going to save the game. And we will continue this in the next couple days, I think. We can ask the sailors next time. So...